11 Turkish soldiers have been killed in northern Syria this on Saturday. Now, among the fatalities are two military personnel whose helicopter was downed in the region. The copter incident took place in Syria's Afrin region during an offensive against Kurdish militants there. Turkish military later said nine more soldiers were killed in separate incidents but did not give any more details. Spokesperson for Kurdish militants in Syria, also known as the YPG, has confirmed that their units targeted the chopper. Turkey launched a military offensive on Afrin in January to uproot the YPG from the region. Ankara considers the YPG an extension of the outlawed group of Kurdistan Workers' Party or the PKK, which is active in northern Iraq and southeastern Turkey. Press TV's Rashad Saglam says an investigation is underway to show how a Turkish helicopter was downed in northern Syria. Here she is. Uh, now, the first uh, person in Turkey to announce the downing of the helicopter was President Erdogan, who said particularly the word the a helicopter, a Turkish helicopter, was downed uh, in Hatay province. Uh, however, all the information, the military information that we got is that the helicopter was actually downed in Afrin, and to be particularly exact, uh, above Rajo town, which is in uh, west, uh, northern, uh, the, the city of Afrin in northern Syria. Uh, now, uh, the investigations are still going uh, on, on how uh, the attack took place and uh, which weapons were used. However, the Turkish government is being very discreet about this information. Turkish president said that uh, it, is, uh, it is okay uh, for these incidents to happen and he said that we are in a war and we are going to lose men in this war however those who are fighting us and those who downed uh, the helicopter are going to pay the price we are going to lose uh, from our military however uh, the enemies are also going to lose from uh, the, from uh, their terrorists and he said that we are going to continue with this fight